Hello, and welcome back to another awesome episode of The Ladder is Playing Roy McElroy PGA Tour 15. I'm just playing a little bit of my career mode. NBC I Golf just Channel. started a new on tournament. EA Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, proudly presents the season long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live opening round coverage of the players. Hello again and welcome, Rich Lerner alongside Frank Nabilo, coming to you from one of the game's most famous venues, the TPC Sawgrass, home to the players. And home of the players too, the uh, PGA Tour professionals that play the tour, um, they basically run and own this wonderful venue. It is their championship and it's one that each one of those players playing here this week would want to win. It might not be considered a major. It is. As you can see, Roy McIlroy and we pick up with Jordan Spieth are up on top. Nothing noteworthy here in the first round, Frank, but still plenty of golf to be played. That's right, Rich. A little bit of a dry spell, but really not a lot of damage done. Mmm. What a drive. Just tap. Settling in that tough start. Getting set for this next shot from the rough, what does the player need to be careful of here, Frank? Well, this is where we're going to see exactly how good they are because, you know, that's exactly the best lie, but it's sort of doable if you, if you know what you're doing. Chance for birdie after that beautiful shot. From Apparently I have some players' championship jitters. Turn those jitters into at least a birdie. Four round tournament, setting himself up for a good weekend, maybe a great one. Star makes his birdie. Good spot to be in, fresh off a of birdie. Yeah, all of a sudden you start to feel like you've got the game in hand. Well, this looks good. Certainly. Frank couldn't ask for anything more. Just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. Now the approach to twelve, Frank. What's the player looking at? Well, it's a fun shot here for the second shot, especially if you've driven to the right side, because then you can see the flag no matter where it is on the green. Terrific golf shot. And now that for the birdie. And this would be nice. Two straight birdies. Two birdies like that, Rich. And even I just might sneak placed on the podium in the top 10 right now. We always like when they have the whole location back left and that ball trickles down, feeds, and you can see some really good ones and maybe even an ace here. Yeah, just like Mickelson a few years ago. It, it looked like it was going to flirt with a bunker, ran up and over the edge, and in it goes. This is one where you have to play ground ball as well as high ball. What a deep shot making this has been, Frank. Oh, that incredible birdie, tied at the top. Now one of the most demanding holes on this golf course, the 14, 481 par 4. If you ever you want a litmus test at TPC, we'll grass on who's playing well, check the tee shots on 14. If you stripe it down here, you know Long you're going par well. 4. Too often you'll see people missing with the Good tee shot, good lie, and now a good chance to take advantage here on this hole. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. This is when this game just looks like f bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only f we're looking at right now is just the flag. That is how it's done right there. What an approach shot. But well within his range. That's 
good birdie right there. Oh, well, there you go. I played four holes, the got four birdies. So through one round, Frank, so the negative four at the end of my play around. Dead wretch. It was truly a great performance, especially from Tita Green. It's not easy to come out of the gates like that. Simulation gave me an extra birdie. But apparently, other people were hitting five. So, I should be starting off this next round with being in first place. Unless the other players have already started before me. And it looks like they have because I'm sitting in third place. NBC Golf Channel on EA Sports in association with the PGA Tour proudly presents the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live second round right, coverage. This is the second of the round players. of coverage. Welcome once again to TPC Sawgrass for the players. This is Rich Lerner alongside Frank Navalo, set to bring you all the action. And Frank, the 17th hole is always the place to be during this great championship. It certainly is, Rich. Uh, the energy, as we know, each and every year has just been electric at 17. And I don't expect it to be any different today. Yeah, no, it's not a good hit. Rich, there's rough and rough. That ball is needle nose down. Can't even I see am it in from the here. Rough, I see sitting so down here, the rough. He's digging in. Let's see if I cover from that. Here's to be what they call a commercial play. Very solid. Just a case of a hole suiting the player's eye. Made the birdie I yesterday. From it, but a good chance to make another have one today. A good lie? Birdie right there, Frank. Oh, time to get another cup of coffee. Things are heating up. Jordan Spieth Frank, at so much negative focus eight. On the back nine here at the stadium course at TPC Sawgrass on the 17th hole with the island green. I think 13 gets lost sometimes, but the pros know this is a really good hole. Oh, it can be disastrous too. That's I think what you're referring to, Rich. There's a big ridge in the middle of the screen that bisects the top side with the bottom side on the left. So even on the left you don't have to go directly at it because that normally causes the problem with the uh, wooden bulkheads side and obviously the water left of that so something on the ridge can often down towards the left but we have odd hole in one here over the years moves into second place birdie frank historically in this great championship 14 has proven to be a pivotal hole Everybody focuses on the finish here, but you're absolutely right, Rich. This can be an absolute scorecard record because if you spin left, the drop back, perhaps on the ladies' tees, you can make six and a heartbeat. You try and air to the right, you can make it on the mound. So a good drive down half, down 14 gives you a chance for that fast finish. No 300. A challenging approach shot here at the 14th. Yeah, there's some subtle green. Uh, one that comes in on the, the right, and then another crazy. one that's about two thirds of the way down on that left side. He's making the game look very simple right now. See it, and he's got it right on track. Just continuing to play some really good golf. Eight under par for the championship. Frank, the 15th has the respect of the professionals. But you're right. This is a positional hole where uh, just keep the ball down the left center. You can't go too far because you'll get blocked out or you'll run out of fairway. From it's really about knowing where the flag is, what position on the green, because this is another green that's not that. If the second shot lands on the wrong portion of the green, it'll finish well away from the hole. Frank, what's the key on this approach here at the 15th? Well, knowing exactly where that pin placement is, Rich, um, there's mounding, there's that little gut out of the right of the screen. If you miss your mark here, you can easily finish 30 or 40 feet away. Really in control of this hole. Birdie yesterday, and another opportunity on the... This is a nine-footer.
So the dominant performance continues. Yeah, we're watching two tournaments right now, the one at the top and the rest. Well, Rich, two rounds in the books, and it's easy to see why the leaders are on top of the board. Excellent performance, but still a long ways to go in this tournament. Finished the day in first place, so that's good. Got a two-stroke lead, so hopefully that means that after the start of next round, I'll still be in first place. That's the goal. And it is a fact that is the way it is going to be. Starting this round off with a one or with a lead. NBC Golf Channel. On EA Sports, Let's association with the PGA a it Tour is. proudly and presents the season one race for the FedEx Cup. It's third round coverage of the players. The good news is I get to play six now holes this turn, so as long as I continue to play as well as I have been, means I could really set myself up with a nice lead. Frank, and what do you make of this hole? It's another one where you're just trying to fit the tee shot in the uh, in the fairway. There, it's not a driver, just something that stays right. And of course. Um, We've seen a lot of people stray here down the left. You can forget Mickelson when he won his uh, last championship. Phenomenal seven iron. Bunker through the trees and putting surface. But speaking of surface, this has more undulations than any green on the golf course. Be pretty good right there. On the safe side. Oh. Frank, he is dialed in. Yeah, that was just some shot on the birdie. Made a par in his previous this time, it's for birdie. Good look. Now, I almost said, right I think this is one gonna be disappointed. That line just did not pocket. look normal. Another good par. Let's go to the 11th now. The par five and a fun hole, Frank. You can make uh, anything from seven here. And that's why, uh, as the start of the back nine, especially this becomes such a pivotal hole to start a big uh, body of left side uh, that some longer hitters can get with the tee shot, but really second shot. If you can reach this par five, it's a nice, it's good a hit, 301 yards. The layup, well, it's Should actually they... awkward uh, because you've got to push uh, that ball uh, to the side, almost like a zigzag approach. That one is going towards the rough. I know that I missed that one. That one's not where I put up. that, but with that. Rough. Frank, what's he facing? Well, the lie first. If it's sitting down, then obviously you're not going to get a very good contact. Nothing wrong with coming up a little bit shorter. The problem is turning one mistake into another. I mean, that's how the game is played. He's just making it look so easy. That birdie coming up, formality. Well, I recovered on that one. Really starting to shine. Moves to 10 under. Frank, what's so much fun about TP dog grass is the excitement that it generates for a fan. And how many different holes there are? Twelve is a good example. Twelve looks like it's fresh from school. You can see why Pete spent a lot of time over there. Um, but look straight away, but the second shot is blind. The, the shot you'd get in Scotland with the you just see the top of the flag stick, and you've got to really guesstimate on the yardage. But a good wedge shot and someone that can distance. That is classy. What a chance of going in. And this will be a five-foot putt here. I don't know why it's glitching out. Yeah, he's made it for a birdie. 
Pole number 13 here at Sawgrass, 181, par three. You don't directly at this flag. When that the back there, you can use the con. It's on the left, once again, you can use it in the middle of the green. In fact, one of the hardest hole locations is when it's right, because that's to be perfect. This hole really sets up well for the player. Yesterday, chance for another one today. This for another birdie hole on the week. Good roll. Fourteen is so often a pivot here at the TPC Sawgrass. It is, Rich. You see a player hit two shots on this green. It's all the problems about four. But when you see someone straight left or straight right, you realize that 14 is real bad. He has given this one the full treatment. Perfect release through the ball. This shot a fairway over 300 yards. Surely not. That is an exceptional shot on the green and in position birdie. Yeah, it's a formality now. Now to the 15th and Frank a hole that you really like. It's no respect in my book, which I think is a shame. Just dollar right and shots and a three here, which is actually a it sets you up for those three holes. Too often people take 15 lightly. 15 has just a gentle nibble that's a bite. Frank, really good in this position. Take a birdie. Yeah, really the only thing right now is the flag. Uh, this is your green lights. Safely on deck. That's an outstanding shot right there, and it sets up a really good look at birdie. Shouldn't be here. And there we go. I complete the round. The records continue to fall. There's nothing quite like the round of a hotly contested champion. Set my route. Just uh, quite like that leaderboard I'm looking at. Right Y'all's in and in. Everyone's watching right now. Amazing but golf. This one is. To upload these to YouTube. I just want to make sure they're good. Try to give. I try to deliver the quality for y'all. Well, I finished up the round in first place. Had a nice eat. Easy five streets. So let's see how I'm going to start off the next round. I'm going to start the next round in first place. That's pretty nice. NBC Golf Channel. Especially since though this is for the Players Championship, I will start off with a two stroke lead. Person that's two strokes behind Today, me is one hole ahead of me, so of that's players. good. So I will know exactly where they're going to finish up by the end of the day. Hazard, maybe wet. Wow, lucky break right there, Frank. Well, who's two strokes, strokes behind me better bring their A game, because. I am going to be bringing my. Score that, birdie. There, there bogey said there. Adventures here at 14. They, well, they would have been three since I got a birdie. Done, he was very, very lucky to get away with six. Uh, had it been seven, there, four yeah, behind. Might have just caught him at the post, but he will and will never forget 14. Ooh, very nice hit. Very nice. Three, three thirty. Frank, that is there position we go. A. Yeah, the tee shot was rich. I mean, just sits up that so beautifully. Oh, this 
passes right at it. Good chance. Birdie, that was an outstanding play. Oh, it's almost a guarantee there after that shot. Makeable putt right here, currently sitting at one under for the round. And he has it. A good putt for D. Just well, before we get to what they had call it, 16, got a par that 18. round. Requires so, attention, doesn't it, Frank? Personally, I think this is on the golf course, Rich, of actually back there and taking pictures. Uh, dog leg to the right uh, you come out of the seems to be a generous fairway view of the bunker down the right side but there's no so lip there so cut. that's not yeah. a concern the no. green uh, it's a weird and wonderful wave on it um, well protected big bunker on the left and there's two little pots well, it is rain life here the first time around seems to like it it's headed for the green Frank, it's not about getting the ball close to the hole from that spot. Well, he had no chance to get it close. Uh, I thought he had very, very, very little chance of getting it on the green. So, given that, that was a very good shot. Don't do that. Cruel lip out. He's made it. Uh, and if well, you're a couple of shots behind on Sunday, one of the people round, who was in second place probably out Burry. Well, history shot it at has, Rich. So they are four down. Uh, Tom Weisskopf was one of my idols. Growing up, I love the way he swung. That right there reminds me of the three hundred. Looks like Rory McIlroy sticking the follow through. Good tee shot, good lie, and now a good to take advantage here on this hole. for the brief swim there Frank he's trying to stay dry now he is uh, just trying to avoid water on the brain as well <laughs> this will take a good swing playing his fourth shot after the third was wet Frank this is one you don't practice but sometimes you have to do it time for the drop yeah it should be the easiest shot in golf <laughs> you've just paid for it Be happy with that. Well, oh, that's where park. it pays off to one be and two, it pays off to be a power Party hitter. Line, isn't it, Frank? And Frank, Hawkins, oh, well, he got another birdie. Follow through, like an Olympic gymnast, staring at it. It looks good, and it yard long. And it makes himself so behind me in a game of inches. Not looking good, Frank. I think it's wet. Just averted but danger right now. Once I there. screw so this, what is he? He is no longer three behind. Yesterday. So unless he got another birdie on 18, he's four behind. Everybody loves him. Yep, he Bird. got a putt on 18. Now to the final hole. PC saw grass, 462 yard par four. Frank, is this? Toughest finishing holes in the now sport. I'm on 18. It is the simple reason the winner and the job done yet. I got a four a stroke right lead. Got Potential to get a, a five this is just stroke. Just a superb performance. Great round to this, Frank, and you can really see Obviously that reflected my goal. in today. 
Yeah, it just looks too easy. Uh, swinging the club beautifully. Ball's going exactly where he, where he wants it to. He's not trying to take too many risks. So constantly getting birdie opportunity after birdie opportunity. Mm -hmm. oh, can't hide the flag stick from that man. Yeah, that burnt the end there. The players' championship. This is to win the players. Simple, solid, and he'll take it. Got one that you need to make. Rich, it came down to just a shot or two here or there, but uh, we were treated to some amazing golf this week. Just one player standing. That was earned, well deserved, beautifully played. All right, well, that was another round of golf with Volaturis. What I'm going to do is I'm gonna actually going to go, since I'm lagging as much as I am, I'm going to go ahead and reset my internet and probably come back on, play one more tournament, and then I'm going to off to bed for the night. But I, I do apologize about the lag. I don't know why it's having so much trouble. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And I will definitely be producing more videos. I just got an achievement. <laughs>